Uh, so the transoral approach isn't actually through the mouth um, necessarily. When people hear the word transoral, they assume we're like putting stuff down the throat or in the bottom of the mouth. Um, it's really on the inside of the lower lip, so between the lower lip and the bottom teeth. And what we do is we just pass little laparoscopic instruments. I don't have a pen on me, but about the size of a pen between the skin and the jaw right here. And we pass those instruments down underneath the skin and get down to the thyroid that way. Um, and in doing that, we can access the thyroid and remove it um, with very good outcomes um, that are essentially equivalent to the traditional surgery, which requires a um, incision across the front here. The main advantage for patients is the lack of a scar on the front of the neck. The scar on the neck is a very visible scar. Um, it's very prominent and noticeable. Um, it's not only noticeable to other people, but it's also something that the patient themselves are going to be aware of on a daily basis. And that's kind of the main benefit of the transoral approach or any of these um, remote access approaches. The whole concept there is to remove the prominence of that scar um, to get it out of the mind of the patient as well as out of the mind of people who may meet the patient.